Law enforcement vehicles are always on the road, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And that heavy toll means thousands of dollars each year per automobile in maintenance and fuel costs. Always in use and always a high priority vehicle in terms of base response and security. So the wear and tear is, is exponentially more than a regular vehicle. In a joint effort, the Air Force Security Forces Center and other Air Force partners are entering a year-long study to test idle reduction technology. If a vehicle is idling for an hour, that's the equivalent of using one gallon of gas. That's also the equivalent of operating a vehicle uh, for 33 miles for one hour of idling. The 502nd Logistics Readiness Squadron on Joint Base San Antonio, Fort Sam Houston, recently hosted a training event where several vehicles had the tech installed giving local security forces and maintenance crews the opportunity to become familiar with it. By reducing idling time, they're hoping to save on maintenance costs and reduce greenhouse gases. What we found preliminarily is that uh, we can actually eliminate 70% of idling in vehicles. So this study will hopefully affirm those numbers. While similar technology is currently being used by several civilian law enforcement agencies around the country, this study is to see if it could meet the needs of the Air Force mission. We're going to take the year to collect all the data. We're going to study the impacts uh, on the mission, on the greenhouse gases, on the miles per gallon, on the idle times, and see how, how it all plays out. And if everything comes up roses, in the next five to ten years being completely you know, in-depth and involved in, in getting that program out there. From Joint Base San Antonio-Lackland, I'm James Truitt.